Good morning from New York. Buenos dias, mis amigos. Today, loving inner mind communication is the journey of the objective mystic in you, an adventure of questions over answers. Have you ever held conversations in your imagination? Have you ever meditated on your thoughts, feelings, or sensations? This is inner mind communication. You have stepped in to the journey of the mystic that is you. You journeying into self-realization. This journey is not a journey to just answers, but to questions. And the love of questions is the beginning of the objective or scientific in or uh, experience of the objective mystic. It is also a journey into understanding the brain, which is the you that controls your experiences and actions that filters out what is important to you from a world vaster than anyone's imagination to fully grasp. So all of this leads us to the great importance of questions, which are essential to the thrill of loving and living. The process or practice of the form of this inner mind communication that we sometimes talk about on this channel brings up questions. And exploring and finding answers to these questions means we must question together and seek diligently to disprove what we think. Those suffering from a lot of helplessness due to damaged faith and love have more difficulty engaging in questions, and cling to the comforts of feeling right over the thrill of exploring and the joy of new discoveries. Que lastima. Before I go into questions that you may have some guesses about or knowledge about, let me add that this channel is also a channel for the politically progressive which means daring to doubt and explore and slow to be certain while focusing on meeting needs of humanity in any society, nation, or location. The path of the questioning objective mystic aimed at love is also the path of the loving progressive. If you identify with the loving mystic in you, you are essential to the life and growth of this channel, this voice of loving reason, this attempt to have everyone in the world to embrace themselves and others with love, no matter what the difference is. So, perhaps, now you realize you are on the path, and always have been, on the path of the loving progressive mystic up to the limits of your capacity to question your bravery to challenge your own thoughts and experience the practices i have tried to outline it here on the channel needs to be practiced in order to explore its benefits and best uses however from outside of that experience the entrance into it must begin with questions about it. Who is it most useful to? Are there other ways to do it? Are some aspects of it more for you than others? Do you have your own process or practice of inner mind communication? Comment with your questions and guesses and observations and consider joining us on our Zoom meetings, either in the recorded and published part or the planning part of the conversation that decides what we will discuss and then publish. Subscribe so that the outreach of this channel can grow. And if 
you have another language than English and wish to comment in that language, feel free to do so. Some in this vast world will know what you said. And there is always Google Translate to create more bridges between us all. The world needs to come together and do so with love. Until we meet again, keep questioning and adventuring. The end of a boring, loveless life is to love and question.